Hey, what's good everybody? Third Rail Beats back with another short tutorial. This one is on time stretching samples to make it fit your project BPM. So let's jump into it. When you open FL Studio, you'll probably be at 130. Um, I like to work at 90, so we're going to change our project tempo down to 90. We're just going to take it and drag it down to 90. Okay, there we go. Now, I have a sample here, a soul sample, that we're going to put in here and make it stretch to 90. Right now, it's at 77 BPM. So we're going to take the sample and throw it into our playlist at 77 BPM, and our project is at 90. Okay, now, as you can see, it's a little over five and a half bars and we want we're working at 90 and this BPM is 77 so the way we're going to fix this without changing the pitch is very quick and easy the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make sure that this is out of time so make sure your metronome metronome is on and play it make sure you're in song mode As you can see, you're out of time. So to fix this, we're going to come to this little corner here where it says stretch. You're going to click it and make sure it has a dot next to it. Okay. The second thing we're going to do is we're going to go to this little icon next to the name of the sample. We're going to left click it and we're going to say fit to tempo. Now we're going to come in and we're going to type in our BPM because our project BPM is 90. So we're going to click it and type in 90 and then click this checkbox. The next thing we're going to do is on our keyboard, we're going to hold Alt and hover over the end of it until we see the arrows and then we're just going to drag it to four bars. We're going to zoom in to make sure that we are exactly at four bars there there it is now all we're going to do next is we're going to keep our metronome on to make sure we're in time but you can tell that you're in time because you can see the beats dropping and the hi-hats and snares are dropping on each bar but let's listen to it sounds really good that's it that's all there is to time stretching samples as you can see it did speed it up but it did not change the pitch